You might know how it goes. You're studying very hard, aka watching some Netflix, and you get a notification from Snapchat. As soon as you open the picture, it turns out to be a tiny little hairy eggplant. Luckily for you, 2019 has brought you a suitable emoji to react with. But are the people that send those pictures just hopeless guys that don't know how to flirt? Or is there more at stake? So today on your favorite YouTube channel, why do guys send pictures of their high pressure vein cane? Welcome to Brains Applied. Before we answer this question, we have to distinguish between two kinds of nudes, the solicited and unsolicited pictures. Solicited pictures fall in the category of sexting. Sexting is defined as sending sexually suggestive or nude images and or sexually suggestive text messages with a smartphone. This happens more often than you think. Even Jeff Bezos does it. An article in Forbes pointed out that 15% of teenagers has done this in the past and about 80% of adults. Please do note that the latter percentage came from an online survey, so you probably don't have to worry about your 90 year old grandma. Although one might expect that you engage in sexting to get a quick hookup, it seems to happen more often amongst people that are in a committed relationship. Research has found two reasons to engage in sexting. It happens when you are in a comfortable relationship and you are in the mood for some genital union, but unfortunately at a time you can't be together. Another reason might be that you suffer from relationship anxiety. Those people are more worried that their partner will leave them or that their partner will think ill of them. Therefore, they want to please them in as many ways as possible. And one of those ways is fulfilling their partner's desire to engage in sexting. The unsolicited pictures are a completely different story. One of the current theories is entitlement. According to this theory, guys that send dick pics are narcissistic guys who believe that they are entitled to have sex. They see themselves as superior to others and they think they should get sex from them whenever they want. This often results in anger when they are being rejected. Additionally, there are researchers that claim that such entitlement is a reaction to feminism and other social developments. Women nowadays are becoming more independent, they get better jobs and more social care than ever before. And this might offend some hyper-masculine men who want to fit the alpha male ideal. If you want to have some fun, I advise you to check the Instagram page by Felipe. They have some pretty good examples of such guys getting mad. Another theory about why people send pictures of their pencil of love is online exhibitionism. The idea of this is basically the same as real life exhibitionism. People showing their genitals to others. Some say these people do it because it arouses them. Other psychologists see exhibitionism as a courtship disorder. It is seen as a disturbance in the regulatory system of normal courtship processes. Or in other words, they try to get you aroused by sending you pictures of their traffic cone. Other studies claim that exhibitionism is more related to narcissism. Meaning that those guys lack empathy for you and that they need your admiration to boost their self-confidence. So when you receive such a photographic masterpiece, you should say something like You have a very beautiful pinky finger. I hope you liked this video. It was a pretty hard video to make because you know, science has not investigated dick pics that well. But, you know, if you have any other theories about why some people might send these uh, kind of pictures or if you have any experience with receiving those kind of pictures, just leave a comment below. Just put it in the comments and we can talk about it. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you receive a notification next week when I upload a new video. And I will see you guys later.